Oklahoma City opens a set of back-to-back -back games against the Milwaukee Admirals tonight. And while Milwaukee doesn't have the loaded NHL-like roster of other teams in the league, they're still a force to be reckoned with. Every, every year Milwaukee puts a pretty good team on the ice and uh, they have a, a great knack for finding talent and they're always a skilled bunch. Uh, they're a dangerous bunch. Uh, they put seven goals up against uh, Chicago. Um, so the thing is, is that uh, we have to be ready to play against a very good hockey team. Uh, you know, for, it'd be really ignorant on our part if we took these guys lightly because I think they're a really good hockey team. You see that they've got a lot of depth on the, on the back end. They've got a lot of skill and, and depth up front too. So that's kind of, be a, kind of starting to be a trend that we're seeing with most of the teams that we play here. So hopefully we'll get a little bit of a better look on the film here in a few minutes. Taking a look at special teams for the Barons, Oklahoma City has been phenomenal on the power play, particularly at home, where they rank first in the league. When it comes to the power play, we've got, uh, I think we've got a lot of skill up front and, and on the back end that we've been able to utilize. And we get pucks moving around and get pucks to the net, and we've had a lot of success here, especially at home. In keeping with the theme of special teams, the Barons haven't been as strong on the penalty kill, and that's an area head coach Todd Nelson knows the team has to address. Through video, through working on things in practice, um, you know, we just have to keep on working at it. Um, lately, it seems like every kind of shot that gets through, it's, it's finding the back of the net, and you know, we got to do a better job of fronting shots, uh, paying the price, get pucks down uh, like when we can, and. Uh, you know, any time uh, guys have second or third wax at pucks in front of the net, uh, that's not a very good thing. So we have to make sure we play stronger in front of our net. Tonight is Caring for Kids Night. The first thousand fans in attendance receive a free Barons lunch tin courtesy of Sandridge Energy. Doors open at 6 p.m. Face-off is at 7 p.m. You can get your tickets online at OKCBarons.com or by calling the Barons front office at 405-232-GOAL. Reporting from just outside of Bricktown in Oklahoma City, Chris Westcott, OKCBarons.com.